Positively, Jacks, a big day for the young brother and sister whose miraculous rescue captivated Jacksonville after they were lost in the woods for more than two days. Just hours ago, firefighters and police took six-year-old Braxton Williams and five-year-old Briah Williams on a shopping spree at Walmart on Normandy Boulevard. And News for Jacks reporter Vic Michalucci tagged along. What a special treat this is, not just for Briah and Braxton and their family members, but also for the first responders who searched tirelessly for the brother and sister. Now they're reunited with the family and they get to have some fun. Where are we going? What? To toy shop. Shopping. You're getting toys? Yeah, toy shop. From the time first responders picked them up to when they got to the store. You ready, Braxton? Yeah. You could tell the Williams kids were excited. This could go with all you little babies. There you go. Remember, we need to look for darts. Firefighters and police officers took the children shopping at Walmart just days after finding Braxton and Briah Williams in the woods near their west side home. Oh man, it's just so overwhelming. You hear somebody screaming that we've got kids over here and it was just hoping everything was going to be good with it as we got in there and sure enough was, you know, kids are alive and well. And after a massive search and so much stress, members of fire and police unions wanted to help the family and together with Walmart, they fronted the money for a shopping spree, not just for Braxton and Briar, but all nine kids in their family. We talked about wanting to do something special for the kids and the family, and uh, this idea came up to take them on a little shopping spree so they'd have a good Christmas. Uh, this is something that really kind of re reinvigorates uh, first responders when, you, you know, when you're working hard for something and you have a positive outcome. Do you want a boy bar or just the girl ones? You want her to do that. At the same time, Firefighters and Ashley Home Store gave the family's house a makeover, donating bunk beds, sheets, and furniture. Mom, so appreciative of everything. Everybody's happy. My kids made it back home safe, and I just thank God. Thank everybody. Just as thankful the men and women who searched and found these special kids. Being able to be with these kids is such an opportunity that I never thought I would be able to have. It's it's a Christmas miracle in my eyes. And the firefighters and police officers that I spoke with say they have had a rough year. They've been involved in a lot of tragedies, and this was exactly what they needed to end 2019. On the West Side, I'm Vic Michalucci, Channel 4, The Local Station.